Rafik Zahir Jabal is an Algerian footballer who plays as a striker for AEK Athens and the Algerian national team. He is known by the nickname The Terrorist as he has the ability to terrorize defenses and due also to his machine gun goal celebrations. Club career equals Auxerre equals, born in Grenoble, France, Jebois was signed to Auxerre's youth academy at the age of 15 in 1998. He was moved to the senior team in 2003 after spending five years in the youth academy. He made his professional debut at the age of 19. Equals Luvia Copyright Royce equals, his impressive debut season caught the eye of RAA Luvia Copyright Royce, in his second professional season. He did not live up to his expectations. Even though he made 21 appearances he only managed to score six goals. Jebel was transfer listed by the club at the end of the season. Jebel mentioned in an interview that he was transfer listed as he wasn't happy with the way the club didn't support him when his brother had been in a coma for five months. He stated he was very disappointed with the staff and became disillusioned and felt no attachment to the club. In July 2005, Jebbo signed for Greek outfit Ethnikos Asteras. Equals Ethnikos Asteras equals, in his first season in Greece, he scored 11 goals in 21 appearances from September to January. This earned him a move to Atramitos where he managed six goals until the end of the season. Equals Atramitos equals, Jebbo suffered a serious injury in his first season with Atramitos this limited Jebbo to only two appearances without scoring. In January 2006, Jebbo called upon one of the big three of Greece to acquire his services, however this did not happen and he ended up at Paninios. Equals Paninios equals, before signing to Paninios, Jebbo went on trial at English club Watford but was not retained as A.D. Boothroyd stated he wasn't what I was looking for. His first six months with Paninios, Jebbo scored four goals in the remaining 14 games. He would go on to score 15 goals in 27 appearances. In the summer of 2008, AEK Athens expressed their interest in signing Jebba. He completed his move to the Dyke Farlos Itos on July 1, 2008. Equals AEK Athens equals, in 2009, Jebba transferred to AEK for a 3.2 million. Jebbo scored his first goal for AEK in the 93rd minute in the home to a Euro 1 win against Astoras Tripolis, giving his club the three points. Jebbo got into a fight with teammate Nako Skoko in a training ground bust up. On September 30, 2009, it was reported that Jebbo clashed with AEK Athens coach Dusan Bajvik and was not allowed to train with the rest of the season for four months. During his absence from AEK Athens training, Jebbo had been training with Celtic and Blackburn Rovers. On 710, Jebbo signed a three-year deal keeping at the club until 2013. Jebbo's contract is worth a 3.3 million with a buyout clause of a 7 million. After signing his contract extension in 2010, he began the 2010 season in great form, scoring three goals in three games for the regular season as well as a goal during AEK's 3 Euro 1 Europa League win against Hajduk Split. On January 2, 2011, Jebbo had another clash, this time with Manolo Jimenez, the current AEK Athens coach. Jimenez reportedly stressed to Jebbo that he is not allowed to attend the next day training and that he should instead meet with the chairman of AEK Athens. After the incident with Manolo Jimenez, Rafik requested immediately to be released on a free transfer by AEK. He also requested to be paid his remaining wages doubled. Lens and other French teams declared interest in buying him. Jebbo threatened AEK's board and was ready to seek a solution in court. However, both sides agreed on a 300,000 and on January 14, 2011, Rafik was released. Equals Olimiakos equals. 2010 Euro 11, on January 21, 2011, Jebbo left AEK Athens and joined Olimiakos signing a six-month contract with the club with the option of renewal for two years. He scored his first goal for Olympiacos in an away win at Ariz after a superb assist of Ariel Ibergaza. That was followed by two goals and a 6 0 0 home win against AEK Athens, a goal against PAOK and the winning goal in a 2 0 one derby win against Panathinaikos. 
He also scored in a home win 3 Euro 1 against Kyvla after an assist of Giannis Maniotis and in the final match of the season, against AEL 1964 FC after a superb assist of Albert Riera. 2011 Euro 12 Jebbor scored his first goal of the season with a last-minute winner in a thrilling home win 2 Euro 1 against Scott Xanthi. Rafik's goal of the season came at a home win 2 Euro 1 against PAOK with an sublime header after an assist of Kevin Myrillas. His first European goal for Olympiacos came in a Champions League home win against Borussia Dortmund. In the domestic league, he scored two goals in a 0 Euro 3 away win against Paninios. He also scored in a home win 2 Euro 1 against PAOK. He scored a goal in a 2 a Euro 2 home draw against OFI Crete and a goal in a 1 a Euro 1 home draw with Panathinaikos. He also scored in a 2 a Euro 0 home win against Pentelikos. His second European goal came in a 3 a Euro 1 home win against Arsenal in a Champions League home game. He also scored a goal in a 2 a Euro 0 home win against PAS Giannina. Jebbor scored a goal in a 7 a Euro 2 home win against Asteras Tripoli. His third European goal of the season came in a 1 Euro 0 home win against Ruben Kazan in the Europa League. He also scored two goals in a 4 Euro 0 away win against PAS Giannina. Jebbor also scored in the Greek Cup final in Olimiakos win 2 Euro 1 against Atramitos. In all competitions, Jebbor made 31 appearances, scoring 12 goals in the Greek Super League and 16 goals in all competitions. 2012 Euro 13, Jebbor started the season with a goal in a 2 Euro 1 away win against Freya after an assist of Holbers. He next scored two goals in a 4 Euro 0 home win against Lovadiakos after assist of Jamel Abdoun. His next goal came in a 2 Euro 1 away win against PAS Giannina. At this match, he made the assist to Konstantinos Mitrogla to score the second goal. He also scored two goals in a 4 Euro 1 home win against Panthrakikos after two assists of Jamel Abdoun and Ariel Ibergaza. He next scored two goals in a 4 Euro 0 home win against Scott Xanthi. As a result of his outstanding performances, the club has offered Jebor a better contract extension. He also scored in a 1 Euro 1 away draw against PAOK. The next goal came in a 2 Euro 0 home win against Panakaiki with a wonderful header at a Greek Cup match. He next scored two goals in an away draw to a Euro 2 at the classical Greek derby against Panathinaikos after two assists of Jamel Abdoun and David Foster. These goals marked his fourth goal in the classic derby Olimiakos Panathinaikos with Olimiakos team. He scored ten goals against Panathinaikos at his charge at Greece and he intrigued illustrious European football clubs such as Olympique de Marseille. His next goal came in an away win 2 a Euro 1 against Paninios after an assist of Konstantinos Mitrogla. Rafik Jebor finished the first half of Greek Super League with 12 goals in 11 appearances. At January transfer window Rafik Jebor renew his contract with Olimiakos until 2016 and make the following statement, After what happened the last few days on my own initiative, I met with the president of Olympiakos. Mr. Marinakis told him of my intention to stay in the team, because the money was never my priority and agreed to be here for the next three years. I want all of the Olympic family to know that he never wanted to leave from Piraeus and would do anything to be our fans happy and to celebrate with me and my teammates' victories and titles. The second half of Greek Super League begins with a goal in a 3 Euro 0 home win against Free with a penalty shot. With this goal has already surpassed his previous record with Olympiacos of 12 goals in Greek Super League. He scored his next goal against Lovadiakos FC. In a 1 Euro 0 away win at the last minute of the game with a wonderful header, after an assist of Juan Pablo Pino. His next goal came in a home win 2 a Euro 0 against Pargianina. With this goal he equaled his previous record of 16 goals in all competitions with the Olimiakos shirt and his previous record of 15 goals at Greek Super League with the Paninios shirt. His next goal came at a home loss to a Euro 3 against Atramitos after an assist of Konstantinos Mitrogla. His next goal came in an away win to a Euro 0 against Skodak 
With this goal he reached 18 goals in all competitions and broke his previous record of 17 goals in all competitions with Paninio's shirt. His next goal came in a home win 2-1 against Ares after an assist of Jose Helbers. He next scores two goals in an away win 4-0 against OFI after an assist of Jamel Abdoun. With these two goals he reached 20 goals at 20 performances at Greek Super League. At a home win against AEK Athens FC Rafik couldn't score a goal but gave two assists at Jamel Abdoun and Evram Papadopoulos. With the win Olimiakos claimed the 40th champion in his history. Rafik made the assist to Konstantinos Mitrogla at a home draw 1-1 against Panathinaikos at the classical Greek derby. He ended the season at Greek Super League being the top scorer, scoring 20 goals in 24 appearances. Equals loan to Shivas Spur equals, on September 6, 2013. Jebbo joined Zar one quarter per league club Shivas Spur on a season-long loan deal from Olimiakos, after the interest of the coach of the club, Roberto Carlos. He played 13 games with the club in all competitions and scored four goals. Equals Nottingham Forest equals, Jebbo joined Nottingham Forest on January 29, 2014 for 1.5 million euros, initially on loan with the deal becoming permanent at the end of the season. Despite a debut goal, Jebbo along with countryman Jamel Abdoun, were dropped by caretaker manager Gary Brazil due to a perceived lack of effort in training and bad attitude. At the end of the season, Forrest believed they could cancel the permanent transfer with his club Olimiakos, but were unable to. On July 15, 2014 it was confirmed Jebbo and Forrest had reached an agreement to terminate his contract. Equals APOEL equals, on August 5, 2014, Jebbo Sign signed a one-year contract with APOEL from Cyprus. He made his debut against Aardborg BK at GSP Stadium on August 26, 2014, in APOEL's 4 Euro 0 victory for the playoff round of the Champions League. Jebbo also appeared in five group stage matches in APOEL's 2014 Euro 15 UEFA Champions League campaign. He scored his first goal for APOEL on October 6, 2014, netting the winner in his team's a Euro 1 registered trademark S2 a Euro 1 comeback win against a fellows for the Cypriot First Division. Your next match day, he scored for a second consecutive league match, netting again the winner in APOEL's 1 a Euro 0 home win against Ney Salamina. On December 15, 2014, he scored twice in APOEL's enthralling for a Euro 4 home draw against AEK Larnaca for the Cypriot First Division. On March 11, 2015, Jebbo came on as an 62nd minute substitute and scored twice in APOEL's 2 a Euro 0 home victory against Anorthosis for the quarter finals of the Cypriot Cup. On March 14, 2015, he scored the equaliser in APOEL's 1 a Euro 1 away draw against arch rivals Ammonia for the playoffs of the Cypriot First Division. On May 2, 2015, Jebbo scored a stoppage time winner to give APOEL a dramatic 3 a Euro 2 win against arch rivals Ammonia and helped his team to move five points clear at the top of the Cypriot First Division, just three matches before the end. On May 24, 2015, Jebbo scored twice in APOEL's 4 a Euro 2 victory against Hermes Aradipon celebrated the double, as his team secured their third consecutive championship title. Equals return to AK equals, on June 17, 2015, Jebbo signed a one-year contract with the option of a further season with AEK Athens, returning to his former club after four years. On November 4, 2015, AEK Athens striker Jebbo took part in training and he is expected to be back in action imminently. The Algerian striker has been missing since the start of the season but AEK manager Gus Poyet can have him back in contention shortly. On December 6, 2015 in a home win against Kalani FC scored his first goal with AEK Athens after his return. International career he made his debut with the Algeria in an unofficial friendly game against Estes in August 2006 and his first official game was the following day against Gabon, which Algeria lost 0 a Euro 2. He scored his first international goal against Liberia on June 6, 2008. 
he played a key role in Algeria Euro unregistered trademark S winning campaign to qualify for the 2010 FIFA World Cup and scored a crucial goal in Algeria Euro unregistered trademark S3 a Euro 1 victory over Egypt in June 2009. He also played at the 2010 FIFA World Cup in South Africa but failed to score. Career statistics, as of December 6, 2015. Equals international equals. Honours. Equals club equals, Olympiacos, Super League Greece, 2010 a Euro 11, 2011 a Euro 12, 2012 a Euro 13, Greek Cup, 2011 a Euro 12, 2012 a Euro 13, APOEL, Cypriot First Division, 2014 a Euro 15, Cypriot Cup, 2014 a Euro 15. References External links, APOEL Official Profile Rafik Jebor profile at Socks Away, Rafik Jebor at footballs.co.uk, Greek Super League official profile and stats, profile at uefa.com.